Contrary to those social media rumors, the Las Vegas monorail is on track to keep transporting people along the Strip corridor, but it's the way it operates that could be changing in a few years. I've been riding this train for 15 years and I ain't ready to give it up. That's how loyal monorail rider Dwayne Beeman responded to the rumors of the Las Vegas monorail shutting down. Other riders weren't too excited about the news either. I know, what a bummer. Drops you off at the main spots and you can walk your way around everything and see everything. Posts circulating on social media over the weekend got people talking about the potential closure of the rail system. I don't actually know what caused that to pop up. But on Tuesday, Las Vegas Convention and Visitors of Authority President and CEO Steve Hill put the rumors to rest. We have certainly no plans to close the monorail at this point. The tourism agency, which purchased the monorail for $24 million in late 2020, said it will continue to run the way it has been. Hill also spoke about the success the system has seen. Results have been fantastic. Those results include the rise in ridership from 4 million to 6 million since tourism ramped up post pandemic and increased profits. So will the LVCVA ever get rid of the monorail? It ain't gonna happen. We got too many people that depend on this, just like the bus. I, I don't know how much control we really have, unfortunately, with that decision, but I would say don't do it. Hill says it's unlikely. Instead, they'll look to repurpose it once it stops working like it should. The agency projected the system had a lifespan of 8 to 10 years when they purchased it, and upkeep could cost millions. Hill said the elevated tracks might someday be used for cars or even tied into the Boring Company system. For Channel 13, I'm Melissa Bethencourt.